Prepare yourself, you're about to learn how to stream. First, we're gonna go ahead and use a computer. This right here is the MSI Katana. The MSI Katana is capable of actually streaming games within itself. So, if you have games downloaded onto the computer already, you can just go ahead, fire up OBS, go to Game Capture, and start streaming right away. But we're gonna talk about console games. Next, you're going to need a capture card. We're gonna use an external capture card 4K 60S Plus by Elgato. Next, you're going to need a Nintendo Switch that says Vitamin D. And finally, you're going to need a monitor. Let's begin. Let's first start with our capture card. This capture card comes actually with three different cables that you're going to need. One, a USB-C cord to power it. Two, a USB-C cord to go into the computer to send information from the Elgato capture card. The third and final cord will be the HDMI cord that comes with it. You can use this to send the image from the Elgato capture card out to the TV or monitor. It also comes with a cord with four different attachments, so no matter where you are in the world, you will have the ability to stream. We're here in the good old US of A. We're first going to go ahead and insert these ports into these ports. The ports that you see in front of you are the USB, the USB power hub, the HDMI input, and the HDMI output. We're going to go ahead and connect the USB-C into the laptop. Next, we're going to just go ahead and connect the uh, power plug to the USB-C to power this on. We're going to go ahead and leave that last HDMI cord right here. We're going to leave it plugged into the out. We're going to save that until the TV or monitor comes out. All right. Next we need is the Nintendo Switch. Let's take the HDMI plug it into the Nintendo Switch and then plug it into the 4K60. Let's go ahead and wake up our sleeping beast over here. switch. Green light is lit. Focus on OBS. Go to the plus sign. Go to video capture device. Click OK. First thing is going to pop up HD webcam. Next, we're going to click game capture 4K604. Yeah, Super Smash Bros. Make sure that Joy-Con free. Press A. From there. Make sure to click OK. And of course, you can adjust this to the right size you want. Next, we have to go ahead and take the Elgato capture card and connect it to the monitor. So that way, we can see the game onto the screen. That means we're going to have to use the last and final HDMI cord and plug this into the TV. And there you have it. You're ready to stream onto the Nintendo Switch. This same step-by-step -step method applies for the Xbox Series X as well as the PS5 and other consoles that require HDMI cables to be used. Have a good one.